Okay, Brandon. <laughs> well, this is Brandon Parker, and I am Taurus Love. And Brandon, I'm going to ask you, what is it about this industry, the fashion world, that you like, that makes you want to be a part of it? I mean, because you you from VA, basketball player in college, and all that other shit. What, what draws you into this business that makes you want to be in it? Mm-hmm. Well, I've always been into fashion since I was a little, a little, little, little tight. I don't know. Uh, I worked retail for about four or five years throughout college. Uh, Nordstrom, Saks, Lacoste. Okay, H&M. up, upscale, upscale. Well, until you said H and M, but you know, upscale. Oh, you gotta start somewhere. You yeah, that was a good start. Right way up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Upscale, upscale retail. <laughs> but um, I don't know. I, I like being well dressed. It's nothing better than seeing a well dressed man, nice tailored suit that's supposed that fits right. A nice crisp white shirt, black tie, polished shoes. Okay. You no. Know, Okay, now my next question is you you've worked in this industry behind and in front. You know, because I found um Brandon Parker as a prepper for my shoot that I did for Uptown magazine with Pierre Woods. You know, he was back there steaming and ironing clothes and shit like that. So he has you know, and you do it for Ralph Lauren and rugby mm-hmm. and, and other other things, you know. So mm-hmm. What is it about, what are some of the things about the industry that you've seen, you know, that you don't like? Oh, well, things I don't see, uh, things I don't like that I have seen, um, it's a lot of, it's a lot of hate. Keep it uh, plain and simple, it's a lot of hate. It's a lot of guys talking about a lot of guys for no reason. Like, well, black, being black, it's already, I guess you can say it's already a, not a setback, which well, shouldn't be, but it's already a setback, and then we're already like crabs in a barrel pulling each other, pulling each other down, like, it's totally unnecessary, it's enough money for all of us out here to get, we should be proud that Brian Peters is doing Macy's, or Pierre Woods is doing polo or LJ is in this magazine or on this blog or Wendell is on this European magazine and walking this runway. We should embrace it and appreciate it and, and congratulate it, not fucking hate. Like it don't make any sense to me. Yeah, I mean I know that when I see them doing things, I'm excited for all of them. I just feel like each one of of them is opening the door for another one to be able to do that, you know. And I'm and I'm like that about photographers as well. I mean, I get excited when I see other photographers doing doing major things or whatever. I just feel like, especially black photographers, when they're doing things, it just it just feels like they swing that door open for me to be able to do some of the stuff that I aspire to do. So. I don't know. I just feel like I wish that those that's some of the things that bothers me. You know, that people can't be happy for someone like me who's only been in New York for a couple of years and came out from the beginning, you know, working with the agencies and helping develop the careers of the the Pierre Woods, the Brian Peters, the Andre Douglas, the Wendells, and all of those guys that we see doing things now, and I don't know, I just, I want to see that we can just be better, better than being that small, yeah. you know, so, I don't know, so, what do you, what do you think is going to take to make that change, do you think it could change? Uh, I don't think so. I think it has to do with on the personal level. I mean, um, it's not just. I mean, it could change on the surface, but deep down inside, if you like, hitting this dude 
I need to push him down because he's making my money, or I need to shine above him, then that's that's defeating the whole purpose. I mean, of course, it's human nature to be selfish and to want more and to to want better for oneself, but I mean, it's it's another thing to want to see somebody else do bad. Yeah, just because you want to shine, like it's. Yeah, I I think it's enough stars in the sky to shine on all of us, you know. <laughs> so, on that note, holler at you people. Let's just try to be better people and 